Do you see the love in the people who are struggling for the earth dance? The sooner we work together, the more we we'll have a chance. For the love that sets you free, only love can set us free. Give us strength to live, and give us strength to work. For your education, for your food, for your people, for the nature of your place. Okay, why no-till? Uh, no-till is the furthering of the organic idea, I believe. It's, uh, it's allowing the soil to develop the way it would develop naturally without us plowing each and every year. We've been plowing for some 10,000 years, and uh, now we're beginning to take another look at it. Uh, I guess the reason I got into it is that I read an article about uh, one-third of the carbon of the Earth's carbon is tied up in the soil, and uh, that impressed me. And every time from uh, the Fertile Crescent when they started plowing there uh, onto every time we plowed new ground, we have released carbon into the atmosphere. And so that is uh, contributing to global warming. So if we stop doing that, we're putting some of that carbon back in the soil. And if we treat the soil right, we keep that carbon in there for a long period of time. Um, so if the soil is such a heavy, heavy duty sink of carbon, I want to honor it. It's also good gardening because it honors all those microorganisms. You have to start using your brain instead of your chemicals. Um, you know, because uh, you have to figure it out. You have to work with nature, and you have to understand her well enough that, that you can pull that off. And I think it's a, an excellent thing to do, and it's it's good for me. I, I hope it's good for you. It, it makes me feel peaceful. I don't know.